what's up guys and welcome to the video so in today's video i'm going to show you how to create a key store with the java development kit okay so android requires that all applications be digitally signed with a certificate before they are installed or on a device or before they are updated and when releasing um, using the android dev bundles you need to sign your application with the key store as well so let me show you how to create a, a, a key store so let's get started now first we need to download the java development kit which is available on oracle okay and then after that we open we need to open the command prompt in admin as an admin and then after that we'll switch to the directory where your java development kit is, insta is installed okay so after that we we'll enter the key to command uh, which we can use to to generate our key store so these are the details you need okay so let's open cmd in and run it as an administrator okay let's uh, let's do it okay yeah right click okay run as administrator Okay, there we go. So let's switch to the directory where the Java development kit is installed. So I'll just copy that and paste it there. Okay, yeah, there we go. So and then we need to, to paste the the command to generate the key to command. Okay, uh, paste there. Okay, so let's create a password. Normally the password should be your key pass, which is, in our case is key password. So I'll just type that. Okay, what is your first name all right my first name there organization unit it stars sim web tech uh, city sarare province sarare okay zw there there we go okay so we need to type y for yes there if you if you don't type y you will just repeat the the process okay there we go successfully created our key store uh, assigned self sign assigned self sign certificate there successful so let's go to that folder that directory you know file manager so that we can see the the generated um, file okay i'll paste the that hit enter okay let's find the file okay yeah there we go do you see do you see our, our file there we go that's our generated keystone so that's our password the key password is our password the validity that's how long you want the the keystone to be, to be valid for um, and then the alias that's your alias name so basically that's why you need to generate your, your keystone with the Java development kit.